What's up everybody? So I decided to do a short little video real quick, um, just uh, keeping up with things and um, put something out there for you guys. This is another little spell short video that I thought you might enjoy. Um, this one has to do with protection. So I know a lot of you like to work with protection and whatnot. So what the heck? Thought I'd do a little spell that I learned a while back. Um, I don't know where I learned it from, but um, it's a pretty cool little spell. And I uh, thought I'd introduce it to you. Also, I'll be back on track getting some more of the more bigger educational videos out pretty quickly. Um, still coming off of uh, a long weekend and a long week, um, so we'll get right back into it. But in the meantime, I wanted to introduce this little protection spell for you guys that you can do to protect your helm. Um, it's really designed to protect your house, and it involves a lime like this one. Um, try to find as small as you can. In fact, if you have access to a key line, even better. But this is just a little tiny line that I got and um, also it involves some push pin needles like this. And we'll get over to the workbench and I'll show you how it's done. Very simple spell, very easy, it involves all intent as you put the pins into the line and the whole time you're doing it, you're visualizing and you're giving the intent of protection. And when it's all over, you hang it up in your house, um, somewhere, wherever it may be, near a door, um, anywhere in your house that you feel comfortable with hanging it. And you just let it sit and you'll, it'll dry out and shrivel up. And that's what it's meant to do. So it just stays there for as long as you can. I do one about every year or so. Redo it about every year. But in the meantime, it's there to absorb all the negativity and shrivel up and take all the negativity. So let's get over to the workbench and we'll show you how it's done. <laughs> 